This is street cars, yeah? Yeah, it is, mate. Where do you want to go? You phoned me earlier. I don't think so. Yeah, you didn't say anything. So he's 147 want to call back and you answered? All oh, right, yeah, yeah, I thought it was the wrong number. Well, you can't speak to my Mick. I've been washing cars, mate. Who's Mick? Mick is my husband. The bloke you've been sleeping with. Come here, you coward! You're off, you booby then, you are! Tim! Tim! The T in his phone, I knew it! Leave him alone, you thought! The romantic hotels, the weekends in Lisbon! I've never been to Lisbon! You leave him alone or I'm calling the police! He's been sleeping with my husband! Mick and me were fine till he came along! Ah. Oh. What do you mean, ah? Oh. It was me who called you. You? Well, Mick left a present in the back of the cab and my mate mentioned he knew him. Uh, the Undertaker did his brother's funeral. You mean George Shuttleworth? Yeah, that's right. I made the arrangements with him. He was very kind. How did George know that it was this Mick who left the present then? Because he came in for a cab when the driver rang it through. I'm really sorry for all this confusion. So why did you hang up when you phoned him this morning? Because when he answered and said his name was Eric, I didn't want to ruin the surprise. Well, how did you know the present was for Eric? Because it had a big bow on it and a card saying, Eric, look, I'm, I'm sorry, but we're only really allowed to give property back to the owner. Well, where is it? Where's what? This present that his husband left. It's not in the office because I've moved it up this morning, believe it or not. It's at home. Why don't you stop asking stupid questions? I know Mick isn't perfect. Oh, well, I mean, who of us are? I was convinced he was having an affair. I doubt that. I mean, he obviously thinks the world of you. How do you know? Why don't you go on your lunch, Tim? No, I'm fine here, thanks. I'm still waiting for an apology. I'm sorry. Sometimes my temper gets the better of me. Yeah, you're telling me. I was so good expecting our first baby. Any day now, a girl. Oh, lovely. Hey, Mary. Hold on. I've got to go. Family emergency.